Close in her third season, the Irish are coached by Muffet McGraw, who has led them to the past three Final Fours. Here, the Irish getting started right away. And guess who? It's Natalia Chanwa. Dominique Williams heads to the bench. Madeline Brooks, the junior, will check in. Here's Breaker, and this time she's able to get it to go. The Irish with a two-point lead, 6-4. The Irish three of nine. Here's Jewel Lloyd looking to add to that. And that one's going to bounce in. So here's UCLA trying to inbounds pass. This one stolen by Mabry. Tried to get it to Yinga Fahir on the break. And it's going to be put in by Kayla McBride. The Irish have the three-point lead, 11-8. We just take a lot of pride in, in what we're doing defensively and we really, we have, we have players like Kamak and, and Jewel and, and Ace and Ariel that are veteran players and they understand the grind of the season and how you have to get ready for every game because for every team that comes in here, it's a Super Bowl for them. Able to pick it up, here's Mabry along past to Taya Reimer, she's going to get an easy lay in the Irish now with a 10 point advantage. Madison Cable checking in for the Irish, she gets a nice pass down low and Natalie Achanwa just waits. On the other end, Reimer with it. Gets it to Jewel Lloyd, and a nice bank shot by Jewel Lloyd. The Irish now up by 14. As Reimer being overplayed that time, and she gets a nice look at a layup. I think it's just our team mentality at this point. I don't think that we're taking anything for granted, and we just go out and we're trying to execute our game plan. A bucket here as we near the end of the first half. Here's a three. A Good three and an open one that time for Michaela Mabry. Yeah, that time caught off guard defensively, but Notre Dame still is able to recover and Lloyd will score in transition. Lloyd, an easy lay in with her right hand off the glass. This place pass. Lemberger tried to cut and then she loses it. Steal by Michaela Mabry. Mabry will get it to Lloyd and there's a lay in for the Irish. UCLA, the Bruins swinging around, trying to get a good shot. Instead, it's turnover. Steal by Mabry here. Trying to put in a shot from the elbow. She's able to get it to go after stealing it away from Dominique Williams. And by the end of the year, Rich, they could be a player on the national stage as well as those players continue to develop. Cable with a bomb from behind the arc. Yeah, that was fun. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it felt good, I'll just say that. Um, I don't know, like I said, my teammates made good passes and found me when I was open. And we played, we called some plays that we knew I might be open. So. It was, it was just working. Yingavo with 24 and Fields with 20 as here's a three, another made three by Madison Cable. Forward position 6-3 and the number 39 recruit in the country. Here's another three and going off, continuing her incredible afternoon from off the bench. What a great day for Madison Cable. That was so fun to watch, uh, so exciting for her to come back. She told me yesterday she was ready and she certainly was. Uh, what a, just a, a fantastic offensive showing. Afternoon, so see how this continues to develop though as their season continues. Whitney Holland, a big day for Fighting Irish women's basketball as they defeat UCLA.